Jimmy Lee Jackson was murdered. And that was sort of the last straw. If there was gonna be a mass march, if you had any conscience of civil rights, you were gonna be there, no matter what. Before we could turn to run, it was too late. They came in from both sides, the front and the back, just beating people. People lay everywhere, not moving. The aftershock of it was heard around the world. There were so many people there from all over North America. We had a minister killed. He was a martyr for a reason, and it's unexplainable, and it's tragic, and it's sad, but greater good came out of it. She was driving people uh, from the march, and it was a black and white group. The Klan's people could see that like a mile away. She got killed. So we had two martyrs. Some days we did 10, 12 miles. Some days we did as many as 18 miles. We literally, in my estimation, wrote the voter ranks out with our blood and with our feet. The demonstrators from families in Selma had put their whole lives on the line to be a part of that march. And isn't the real question, why wasn't everybody there, everybody in this country that watched their fellow people being massacred? Jimmy Lee Jackson was murdered. Reverend Reva was murdered. But when Viola was murdered, it shocked the nation. And it's sad that it took the death of a white woman to shock the nation enough because so many African Americans had given their life. Jimmy Lee Jackson was killed, was murdered. His death went unnoticed. Too much blood was shed, too many people's lives, too many people we don't even know about were killed. It's a lot of people fought hard, lost their lives just to get something simple like the right to vote. People have died. We was trying to get our voting right. And people should get out and vote. You can't change the system if you're not in the system. You can't sit back and just complain about it. You gotta get in there and where you can be able to change it. What, what we have to do here in Alabama is we have to get all the rights to people that we can register and then get them to the polls to vote. If you don't vote, you're hopeless. Vote because your vote counts. Every vote counts. No, I'm going to go. If I'm crippled, I'm going. I'm going to vote.